like oh y'all B wagon or the rover. I put some ice on you cause you gotta go. I know I gotta keep my shorty on go. Got that ass to go. Okay, y'all, so I am on the trail walking Bentley, and I'm going to tell y'all about my COVID-19 vaccine experience. So, it went super quick. They have it running like a well oil machine. Like, it was like you went to one area, you check in, went to one area, you sign your consent form, went to one. Like, everybody, it was so many people there, like, directing you where to go. It was running, it ran, like, so smoothly. So... Um, I got my shot. It took like less than, I want to say less, definitely less than 10 minutes. So, um, I haven't, it's, it hasn't been that long since the shot. So far, I have not experienced anything out of the ordinary. So, of course, it's still super early, but so far, so good. When I got the shot, um, when she gave it, like when she stuck me with the needle, I was bleeding and, um, and I started bleeding like a lot, uh, not a lot, but I had like drops of blood coming out and, but she was like, you know, some people bleed more than others and usually people with bigger muscles bleed more. So y'all know what that mean. I'm big body over here. Got the muscles. But yeah, so it went good. Um, you know, I have to go back in a month to get my second dose. And then I'm done. Oh, it's wet out here. I wish, almost wish I wouldn't have came here now because the track is super wet. But we gonna make do. But yeah, y'all, so today, what else do I have to do today? Oh, I called and made an appointment for my car to get serviced and it's gonna be on tuesday i was hoping it could be sooner but it's okay no big deal so tuesday i'll get my car serviced me and bent bent we on our walk after the walk i'll probably eat because i haven't eaten anything and it's probably like almost one now so we'll i'll probably eat some something I'll probably make myself a quick breakfast meal and then after that, I want to get some work done with school, and we will go from there. But I'm just going to finish my walk with the vent, and I'll see you guys in a bit. I just did my makeup and I did my makeup because I'm about to do a skincare routine and I want to give the full rundown of just a full-fledged skincare routine which includes taking makeup off so I had to do my makeup for that um, I wish I had somewhere to go because my, my makeup came out okay and yeah but I don't have anywhere to go so I'm just taking this makeup right off and I'm about to film my skincare routine it's 8 18 now i don't know when the last time i talked to you guys was but it's been quite a while later i had a class at three i did some homework um, my arm update on the covid vaccine my arm did start hurting like pretty bad it wasn't like anything unbearable or anything but it did start hurting pretty bad but it went away and i'm hoping it doesn't come back it is still just like a slight bit sore still but it's by no means hurts like it did 
when I after I got here and I tried to lay down a little bit that's when it really started hurting and but it's gotten much better since then and it's not like super bad now it's just like a little sore it's back to like how a flu shot would be so yep that is just all that's going on I'm gonna try to hurry up and film this skincare routine because tonight I definitely want to get my I have a video that I want to finish editing so I can get it posted to schedule to post out tomorrow. So I want to get that done tonight and I would like to try to get started on some cleaning around the house tonight as well. But if that doesn't happen, it's still kind of early and I don't have anything going on super early tomorrow. So it should be, I shouldn't have to, you know, I should be okay. I should be able to get some stuff done. I am just going to go film this video and you guys be on the lookout for the skincare routine. Also, I wanted to tell you guys, if you haven't, go ahead and subscribe, like, comment, share this video, turn on post notifications, do it all, all of it. Hey vlog, I almost forgot about y'all. Um, I finished, I just finished doing my skincare routine, as y'all can see, I'm all shiny, glossy. But yeah, I finished doing that and now I am going to edit this video um that i want to get posted tomorrow so i'm gonna do that now my least favorite part about doing my makeup is cleaning up after i'm gonna take care of that first and then i'm gonna start editing the video and then depending on how i feel i will try to clean up a little bit around the house just really depends on how i feel because i'm getting a little bit tired but we will see. I've been very productive today. So happy about going to the gym and I felt so good. I didn't feel super tired and I lifted a lot. Today was leg day and I really pushed myself with the weights. So very happy about that. Hey y'all. So I am back. Um, today is set. No, it's Friday. Today's Friday. And last time you saw me was late last night. I think I had just finished filming a video and right now it's like almost three o'clock. I just got a video uploaded. So if you haven't seen it, go ahead and watch the Q&A video on my channel. I just got that up and posted. And today I have been a little bit lazy um, update on the COVID vaccine. So my arm has like really been hurting. So like, and it goes back and forth between being just a little bit sore as if it's like a flu shot to being like really hurting to the point where I don't even want to move my arm. And then on top of that, my legs and my butt are super, super sore from my workout yesterday because I really went in on my workout yesterday. So I'm just hurting all around. So that's why I've kind of been a little bit lazy today, but I'm about to get up and get some stuff done. Um, I don't know what I want to do. I think I might make a coffee. Maybe I'll make myself a coffee and then um, I need to go get some packages, but I'm waiting on my friend because I want to get hers too. And then, so I'll do that and sometime soon. And I still want to work out today, but I think the best thing for me to do is maybe do like a lower impact at home workout. So I'm going to try my very best to get that done today. But I still want to keep myself in the swing of working out, even though I feel like my body feels bad, but I'm still going to keep myself in the swing of things. Okay, y'all. So I'm out with Bentley and this is what he decided to do today. He's going to continue to make it worse. I'm sure. Hey y'all, it's like five o'clock now. And right now I am just doing a little bit of homework. And then after that, I am going to try to um, get my workout in still. I'm gonna try to do something quick. I haven't done it yet. I've been kind of like moving at a slow pace. I've been on the phone with a couple of my friends and just moving slowly. I got some stuff from Fabletics. I am a member of the Fabletics vip whatever it is i'm a member of that so i picked some stuff up and they were having a really good sale so i got these just regular these burgundy leggings and the matching sports bra and then i got a three-piece set which comes with the shirt the sports bra 
and the leggings. So I got those all for myself. And then I just got my friend Maya something because they were having a really good sale. And she always gets me stuff. So I pick her stuff up as well. And yeah, after a little bit later, like around 7, Jocelyn and I were going to go pick up some shisha for hookah. And so we're going to do that. And then the rest of the night I'll be in. Um, I'm planning on cleaning and just relaxing. I've been, I really want to get back into reading because reading is just such a, it's just such an act for self-care. So right now I'm just studying for an exam that's due Monday and it's over CT and IR. And CT is commuted tomography and IR is interventional radiography. So I'm just working on those two things right now and i will get you guys updated i'll probably talk to you guys after i do my workout i probably want to make myself a coffee between doing my homework and then working out i'll make myself a coffee okay so i am back and right now i am about to make myself a coffee i just let me get some light in here sorry but yeah i just um finished doing my like at home workout i just did abs today it was going to be ab day even if i went to the gym and now i kind of regret it because now my entire body is in pain i'm just closing the blinds for the curtains for the night because it is getting late and you don't want people looking at your house at night time while you're sleeping in your jammies or whatever so yeah I'm about to let Bentley outside. We didn't go on a long walk today. It was a little, a little bit chilly. It wasn't cold, but it was a little chilly. But yep, so I'm about to get some coffee going and I will show you guys how I do it. And I'm gonna be using this blender that I bought the other day. I showed you guys. A little hand mi hand mixer. I'm gonna use that. It's the box is open because Bentley did that. And I am going to be making a whipped coffee. So to start your whipped coffee, you need to put some water on the boil some water, and you only need two tablespoons. So don't you don't have to boil a lot at all. The recipe for the whipped coffee is two tablespoons of water, two tablespoons of instant coffee and two tablespoons of sugar i don't use two tablespoons of sugar because i do use a um syrup like a caramel or vanilla syrup in my coffee so that has a lot of sugar in it so i don't use the full two tablespoons i'll do like half a tablespoon of sugar i have my instant coffee here i just have a walmart brand classic roast instant coffee you can use any type of instant coffee you like but please do not make the mistake of using like regular ground coffee because I did that. It's not the same thing, it does not work out. And I am going to be using a caramel syrup and just regular granulated sugar. I get a bowl and keeping you guys updated yesterday so i ended up just going to dinner with my friend maya later and we were just catching up with each other don't mind my bed i haven't made it yet for the day but yeah so we were just there catching up with each other and um today i just made a chiropractor's appointment for one and i have a shift order that i'm gonna do and it's just a delivery only so i don't have to shop it or anything and then I'm gonna go to the mall because I have some $20 off 50 Victoria's Secret slash pink um, rewards cards and I just 
they expire March 9th. Today is like almost March 9th. And you can start using them on the 24th. And I think today is like the 27th or something. So I was slipping. I forgot about them. But yeah, so I'm going to take advantage of using those. I have like five. Probably going to be able to use all of them. But I'm going to try to use as many as I can. To the chiropractor. So I'm a little bit scared. But... I'm gonna show you guys what I have on today. Well, I'll wait until I get downstairs to show you guys that, but it's just a little workout set. And right now, I think I'm gonna you know, put my wig down for the day. I have on a green with red hair, and I don't know how I feel about it. I feel like I need to not wear this wig today, because I don't know, can you wear colored hair with colored clothes, like bright colored clothes like this? Mm -hmm. I think I'm gonna do it though, so. Hey guys, right now I'm in the chiropractor's office and I am about to get my back cracked. Hopefully it turns out good. I'm really nervous because I've never done this before and yeah, and I'm vlogging in public. That's scary, but okay. So hopefully y'all can see some footage of how it goes. Hey y'all, so at Chili's, I needed some comfort food after my chiropractor visit and I feel better as far as like mm, my body I didn't experience a lot of cracking like oh this is Jocelyn by the way I did not experience a lot of cracking which I, was a little alarming but the lady said I wasn't in severe my body wasn't severely damaged like normal people I guess so that's why she said there wasn't a whole bunch of popping noises being heard. But my wig was coming undone. <laughs> and the lady literally grabbed my head and said, it's okay. So I was very traumatized by that. They were nice people. And they were, you know, it was okay. I just don't know if I'll be back. And it's nothing, you know, she didn't do anything wrong necessarily, you know. It was just a very culturally un, what do you call it? It was just like a, it was, both of us were in culture shock. Yeah, that's what it was. Both of us were in culture shock and yeah, very, I'm gonna call my mom about this. You talking about you and the lady? I mean me. Me and the lady. Me and the lady. She was in culture shock and so was I. <laughs> and we haven't been to the mall i'm not going to get my facial because i just i don't feel like i just i've had enough culture shock for the day i don't feel like going to get my facial i don't know i just feel like an appointment yes i don't think so I'm just not gonna show up. But um <laughs> Yeah, I'm not showing up to facial. I'll do it another time, another day. Today I've had all I can do with the close contact of people because that was close a close contact activity and a facial is also a very close contact activity and I don't think me or my wig can take it today. Okay, so I never showed you guys my outfit. This is a two-piece workout set from Fabletics and is from the Maddie Ziegler collection. And I've had it for a while, but this is just how it looks. I just ate, so I'm a little bloated, but yep. So now it's time for a haul. You know, I have a haul in every vlog, so haul time. You wanna go first? No. Okay, I'll go first. Hey guys. Oh, we should have a bathroom Oh yes, we should have some, yeah, some tea time with Girl, did you hear about tea? Girl, you believe it? I don't know. It might have to be. Okay, y'all, so we're going to sit down and show y'all a little haul. As you know, what's a vlog without a haul? So, first, we're going to start with Ulta. Let's go with Ulta. I didn't even be too crazy. I just got this mascara or this eyeliner i'm sorry from wet and wild and i just got you know nothing too fancy because i only use my eyeliners for my my bogey marks 
when I do my makeup. And then I had I got this mini continuous setting spray. They only had the big one in the mattifying uh, setting spray, and I don't like a matte finish. I like a dewy finish. I didn't know they had the small um, sizes of them sprays. They only had this one. Hmm. And from Ulta, I'm not quite sure where my bag is right now, but I just got the Anastasia Beverly Hills foundation and I got it in the color, was it 470C? 470C, I'm pretty sure that's what it was. And that's all I got from Ulta. Yep. Okay. It was next door we went into was pink. It was pink, yes. Victoria's Secret slash pink. So you go first. I got this matching brown panty set and it's in a chocolatey brown color. Super cute. I feel like it's gonna give off skim vibes. Like it's gonna it's giving me skin. So that's why I got it. Skim Kardashian period. Sponsored me. No, it's fine. <laughs> and then I got these track pants. I really didn't look for these. They never really had my size every time I go in there. But they finally have my size and I really like these. They're super cute. They got the pink going down the side. And they got zippers at the bottom, and hopefully I can fit them. They cute. They look big. They look too big, actually. Then I got this honey scrub. Um, I love using body scrub while I'm in the shower. Heard good reviews about this, so I got that. And then the cocoa oil. And uh, yeah, so. <laughs> and, <laughs> and then they gave us free hand sanitizer. So that's all I got. Okay. From pink, I got, in Victoria's Secret, I got, so I had some cards, the $20 off 50 cards. I had a few of those, so that's why I would wait there, honestly. So I can use those before they like expire. Not a big fan. Oh, okay, so I got these little sports bras. Y'all know I like to work out, so I got some sports bras. They were two for 45, so I got the two. I got five for 30 underwear. I'm not showing y'all my underwear, but I got five pairs. I got the deal for the perfume. It's, um, you got a 1.7 ounce a lotion in the bag. It's a cute little bank of bag, too. Mm -hmm. oh, yes. I got the scent, it's very sexy. Very sexy. Y'all yeah, know I got very sexy night already, so I like very sexy better though. It smelled. You yeah, said it smelled like me. Yeah, I do. That was that. Oh, that was teas that I said smelled like you. No, you said tea smelled really good, but you, this was the first. That one was the smelled. one. Oh, okay, yeah, that's you. Yeah, that's. Me. Ooh, about and then I got the three for twenty five, and I got this scent by itself because I think I got the spray. If I didn't get the spray, then I got the lotion and so I'll just return this and go get the spray. And then I got the Bare Vanilla La Creme because like it ain't the, the same as Bare Vanilla. You like that one? I didn't smell it, honestly. It. But I know I like Bare Vanilla. And so I feel like Bare Vanilla Cream, La Creme should sound, be similar, but a little bit. Yeah, it's similar vanilla. It doesn't smell like vanilla. It don't got nothing, but it smells good. Yeah, it do. And I like then I got the two for 30 fragrance mist um, body care in the scent teas. And I got my free hand sanitizer. Purr. Purr. Okay. Moving on to Throw an extra Marshalls. Ooh. This is the one out. <laughs> oh, wait. I got some Target. I have oh, some yeah. Honey Pot Wipes. That's about it. I ain't getting nothing from Target. Stop biting me. Surprised and proud of myself. Okay, guys. I'm excited. I can't wait. Okay, so I have these 24K Glow Under Eye Masks. Love those. I've been looking for under eye masks all, like, all week. Every time I always go to the, what is it called? The skincare section on my job. I don't ever have it. I got these cute fluffy slippers. Because I was supposed to get some slippers from Pink. They mm -hmm. cost too much. And that wasn't sure. real. It was $35. Yeah. Mm -hmm. These was what? $19.99. Stop playing with me. Anywho, I got a candle. It is Unwind. And it's lavender and blue sage. And it smells really, really good. She doesn't like the one with candles. Uh-uh. I told y'all about this already. And then I got these um, hand towels for my bathroom. They say relax and they have lashes. 
And I have a painting in my bathroom that, you know, it goes with that aesthetic. So I'm gonna put that in my bathroom. And then I got this Becca Hydro Mist Set and Finish uh, Refresh Powder. It's just like a setting powder. And then I got also from Becca Cosmetics is this Luminous Blush. Oh, I forgot I did get this blush. Oh, this. <laughs> and also, ooh, this the one. This the one. I got this Laura Mercier um, Flawless Radiance Foundation for $15, y'all. And I'm then, sure it's the forty-five dollar foundation. Lastly, I got this uh, body mist, body spray by Paris Hilton. It's called Can Can. And it smells really good. Let me see. Yeah, that smells good. Yeah, that smells good. I can see myself wearing it every day. It smells like you. Yeah, really. Good. That's how I thought that was my nice. <laughs> <laughs> And that's everything I got for Marshall. We okay. should do a guess how much we spent at each at each place in yeah. the comments. Yeah, cuz baby, y'all, <laughs> let's, let's do a grand total. Try to guess how much we all, we both of us spent in total in the comment section below. So, moving on to my Marshall's purchases, I bought these this eight pack of beautiful sponges. No, and it was eight dollars, so a dollar per beauty sponge can't be that much. And I'm probably just gonna because beauty sponges, when I try to clean them, they never get clean for, for me when I do it. So mm -hmm. I'm really just probably gonna get rid of all my old ones, unless it's like a really good one. Like if it's a real techniques or something, I'm not getting rid of that. But all the other ones, I'm just gonna get rid of and just start over. Did you try the, did you see that method where they put it, put it in the hot water and put it, I mean, put it in water and put it in the microwave uh -huh. and clean it and it cleans. Mm. You should try that. Okay, I'm gonna try that before I throw them away. <laughs> okay. All right. I also got a candle. It smells super, super good. It's called white cotton, and it just sounds like laundry. Yeah, it apparently smells like my house. Which, it does. If this is how my house smells, I'm very happy about that. Mm -hmm. I think it was that one plug in that you had. Mm -hmm. It's in the bathroom, I think, right now. In the spring. See, look, you did it. Mm -hmm. You know, you'd be like, I don't care about stuff like that. You'll get a Christmas <laughs> candle in July. I will get a Christmas candle in July. I don't care. I y'all, I had a peppermint candle up here the other day. Sick. <laughs> I also picked up some more of those in shower body oils that I was telling you guys about. And I got the scents lavender and lilac and jasmine lilac. and rose. And I think I've had both of these, but I just saw them and I just picked them up because they don't always have these. But I just don't ever want to run out of these. That's how strongly I feel about it. Mm. How do you run out? That's a lot of product. And I got this. This is technically for in the kitchen. But I got this as like a perfume tray, like a perfume, like it doesn't spin or anything, but I think it's still gonna be cute to display my perfumes. And it was only $7, yeah, it was only $7. So I just think it's super cute. I'm gonna display all my luxury perfumes on there. Well, no, I'm just gonna display all my perfumes on there. <laughs> What's, do you got non-luxury perfumes? Mm -hmm. mm. Like Juicy Couture and stuff. And like, I got Paris Hilton and Stuff like that. That's Ariana Grande. It's like a different because it's celebrity. They call it, they put that in a different category. Mm -hmm. I feel like they call that celebrity, which I still don't think. But mm -hmm. yeah. Oh, yeah. And then I got Victoria's Secret. They don't consider oh, that, that luxury. That, that's what I meant by it. okay. That makes sense. You just that's what I mean. You got non luxury. Oh yeah, that's mm -hmm. non luxury. Okay. And maybe higher than the That's what I was saying. Yeah. I said that in the video. I said that in the video. Like, y'all, this be trying to sleep on Victoria's Secret. Victoria's Secret perfumes is not cheap. Ooh, I'm excited about this, y'all. If y'all saw me in a, I can't remember what video it was, but I said I went to Marshall's and I saw Daisy Ooh, so Fresh and I didn't pick it up because I thought I had it and I didn't have it and I was mad at myself. Y'all, they had it again. It's so well, cute. I'm going to buy that just for the bottle. That's the type of smell it is. Mm, it's very nice. Smell first, it's yours. Mm. Mm. I like it. I feel like I've had that before, but I think exactly. I only had the travel spray. So I think crazy. I had the travel spray. That's a good, that's good, that's good though. It smells really good. It smells good. And the that bottle is super pretty. cute. So, yep. Good price. Got that. Happy with my purchase. Have it, um, at least I can have like a scratch and stick on the outside. Yeah. Damn. And how much was it? <clears throat> it was fifty nine ninety nine. 
that's not that good of a deal, honestly. But it was still a little deal. Bentley, some Look, Bentley. treats. You want one, Bentley? I got some more pajama shorts. It's a two pack. I don't know why I feel like a breakfast. I'm just smoking or something. I'm <laughs> I got some hemp um, lotion. I like to use this as like hand lotion in my bathroom. And I got a makeup case or travel makeup case for when I go like on a little spend in the night trip. I got something to put my makeup in. Weekend trip. Or even like if I go like actually go on vacation and this could, you know, you can get this as a check bag. Definitely. If you, if you want to pay for that. But definitely, definitely. It's definitely sturdy enough that you could get it as a check bag. So that's all I got from Marshall. I feel like we're missing something, but I guess not. Yo, I'll kill that bag. That's yeah. I hope it's in the car. It gotta be. I don't know if it was. Yeah. I hope I didn't drop it. Oh, Somebody yeah. will come up. That's it, you guys. And today is Sunday, so that means tomorrow I have to go start clinicals and start my week. And I really had a good time vlogging with you guys. Oh, update. I, I don't know if I, I definitely didn't go to get my facial. I just, I just didn't have it in me today. So maybe I'll do that sometime next week. Um, but yes, thank you guys so much for tuning into this vlog. I really appreciate the support. If you want, you can go ahead and like, comment, subscribe and turn on those post notifications. I ain't no play, I just had a lot of pain. But let me tell you, I like him a lot, man. I wanna start at the top and the bottom, man. Now you wanna shoot with the red bottom, man.